Jessica Newton will be after that. Isaiah McCann then after that. So Heather McCann next. And then Jason, our, our folks um, set the clock so they can see it. It stopped it in, in the middle there or at the end. Let me know when to go. Hold on one sec. Do we have a clock, guys? Okay. All right. Um, go ahead. Um, the The clerk will start the timer, and she'll give you a warning in one one minute. Is that okay? Yeah. Heather McCann. All right. My name is Heather McCann. My address is on file with the clerk. Thank you for letting me speak tonight. I do obviously want to speak about what happened at the last school board meeting. Um, that was shut down due to a, a disruption a Democrat committee chair had. As mentioned previously, her name was Tanya James. She and many others that are teachers with this county or staff members were here with her. They all looked to be together. The first ladies that spoke here tonight at the podium were in that crowd. Parents did not shut this meeting down. The meeting was delayed due to a closed session prior to us coming out for this meeting. So we waited. While waiting at one point, a veteran in the room asked if vets were present, which several were, and proceeded with singing the national anthem. After we were done singing, Tanya stood and shouted at the gentleman sitting behind her. I don't know why, and others sitting in the crowd, she also yelled at. <clears throat> when we were done singing, she shouted more at the gentleman behind her, along with other people in the crowd, yelling, F you, and sharing some other vulgar words. We called for security quite a few times, which never happened. The security didn't come until the rest of the people that were with Tanya showed up, and then we were dismissed from the meeting. All of this was on video and has been shared several times in many ways on social media, news platforms. What, I, what seemed suspect to me that night was there were several news channels, news stations that were there that seemed odd to me that were recording this footage and the footage was manipulated in several ways. Even one of the news stations posted a picture of me and my son front and center exposing, I mean, not exposing, but spreading lies, which was what they said did not happen. Once we were all outside, since we were told to leave, we were talking amongst ourselves and shared one minute things. warning. Okay, thank you. My son spoke, spoke bravely in front of the crowd. He is sitting behind me tonight. One of, the, one of the ladies in that crowd with Tanya James heckled at my son and yelled at him while he was speaking, which was incredibly rude, and no adult should ever talk to a child that way. How dare these women, who are apparently st county staff members and teachers, act in such a way? Would you do that to your children or your students? My son respectfully responded with telling all of them that he hopes they come to the Lord and may God bless them. Again, there are videos for proof. He continued to say that we shouldn't have to come to this and we shouldn't shout at each other. As his mother, I am incredibly proud of him for that moment. My child didn't react with revenge. Instead, he was respectful and glorified the Lord. How my son, I was extremely disappointed at how my son was yelled at and how this meeting was wrongfully dismissed. I am proud to stand here with the parents behind me tonight so we can discuss how we feel because our that's voices. time, Ms. McCann. All right, thank you. Jessica Newton. <laughs> Jessica Newton.